The caber is in a weird spot right now. The weapon is not even remotely good for any serious play, but it has some application for some silly and fun gameplay. It can work in a specific environment, in other words in one specific loadout. Let's break down the stats first. 20% slower firing speed and this weapon also deploys 100% slower, also no random crits. Doesn't sound good, right? It gets worse, because there's one unlisted stat that makes the caber as bad as it is. It doesn't recharge on its own after you exploded it once. You have to run to the respawn room and touch the cabinet to get it back. So how much damage does the caber do? The caber deals melee damage of 55 as well as explosive damage of 65 or something. This explosion obviously happens only once and the demo himself takes 52 to 56 self damage. This means you can't even one shot a light class with it. To be honest you can do that with the trick. For some reason you can crouch before hitting a light class to kill them in one shot. However, this is hard to pull off at an enemy that is aware of you. Compared to the stock bottle, the caver is so much worse. It deals only 55 damage and it deals no random crits. That means with a broken caver you need 3 swings and a light class to finish them off. No random crits also hurts a lot, especially if you compare the caver with the stock bottle which crits like crazy. In one exploding hit with the caber, you deal only 116 to 119 damage, which is a lot less than 195 of a crit swing with a bottle. The caber also lifts you in the air after you explode it, which makes it very difficult to follow up with another swing. So why would you ever use the caber? The answer is you shouldn't, and rightfully so. Almost nobody uses it. At least that's what you think. Only some people who are out of their mind to use this shitty weapon can appreciate it. I love weird weapon loadouts. One of my commenters left this comment. Loadout idea. Demo with the splendid screen, the caber and boots. Thanks for the suggestion. Winter 007. The splendid screen gives a crit when you impact after a long charge. This crit counts for both the explosion and the melee damage, resulting in around 340 damage in total for a crit. This can one shot everything except an overhealed heavy. This suddenly doesn't sound so bad. The only way to make the cable work is this loadout. Thank you Quenta007. La Quanta, por favor. <laughs> With the splendid screen, the caber can crit, which is great. It still sucks to run around with a broken caber, which can only deal 55 damage without being able to random crit. The shield also works around that. The guaranteed crit you get lets you deal 165 damage. This can kill every light class and also medics. It's easy to follow up with a normal swing of 55, so you can even hunt for pyros, soldiers or other demos with a broken caver. Demo Knight with the splendid screen seems to be the way to go if you want to use the caver. The fact that the caver also deploys so slowly gives it even more reason to not use it in a regular Demo Man loadout, but with the Demo Knight. The boots give you an additional 25 health which really helps with that self damage you take. And the extra move speed is really appreciated. So we found out how to make use of the caper. They say knowledge is power, but that's bullshit. The right application of knowledge is power. That means the only thing left to do is to try it out. Alright, here we go. So let's test it out, right? <laughs> Demo has gained a little weight. It's time to train it off by charging towards the enemy. But it'll be all for nothing because I explode. 
All the training in the world is useless if you explode anyway. Ah, that's a mini. Can I get up here? Yes. Come on. Okay, spawn is right around the corner. Okay, sentry is gone. Let's see what I can do. Ah, miss the pyro. And there's another one up. So, kind of a waste on the sniper. Because he was kind of low anyway, I think. Let's just push it in. Oh, good. Yeah. As I said, you need three swings, which is really bad. Well, I'm right at spawn, so... So I'll just get back and refill my cave, huh? Ah, no health. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> he's done. Okay, maybe the sentry is gone. It is, yeah, nice. Ah, I didn't get the second swing. The slow swing speed uh, really became my detriment here. Nice! Got the heavy. Ah, oh, and there's no health. <laughs> of course not, there never is. Okay. Nice. Let's just push. I can't do much anyway with my broken cable. Nice! Ah! <laughs> Was about to charge him. So let's push. Dead ringer. What's up with people exploding? <laughs> okay. Kaboom! Ah, almost. <laughs> okay, first round is over. <laughs> I kind of bottom score and getting nominated by half the enemy team. <laughs> but it doesn't matter, it's kind of fun to just charge in and wreak havoc with the suicide bomber loader. <laughs> Mad pig. <laughs> There's another one. No! Dude. I survived. <laughs> okay, now I can try one more time. Nice. Ah, but he death ringed. I didn't get my revenge. Oh, he jumped.
Okay, let's suicide. Nice. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Medic, I need heals. Thanks. Thanks, buddy. Okay, let's try again. Let's go for a blind one. No. Bad idea. Mm -hmm. Bro. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I didn't make it to the MVP. What a surprise, right? Yeah, but this loadout is hella fun. Buddy. No, oh no, it's over. Yeah, I mean, I can really recommend this. You know, the little dopamine rush that you get from Double Donks with the loose cannon. If you experience this, yeah, um, going in for a charge crit with the caber, it's on a whole different level. I can really recommend it. Yeah, um, thanks for watching this video. Again, um, I would really appreciate if you have an idea, then just post it in the comments. Yeah, and I will um, get to it. If it's your first time watching, I'm doing weird weapon loadout gameplay, other gameplay commentary, challenges and rambling videos. So yeah, um, if that's of interest to you, feel free to subscribe to not miss any new videos. I repeat myself, thanks for watching and see you guys around. Bye.